but Bronner takes a, the butt of his stick from Whitcomb. And now fighting in the near side post. Bronner not dropping his gloves just yet. He's wrestling with Mafuz. Oh, these two An guys. aggressive hugging match. <laughs> yeah, the, the, Bronner and Mafuz certainly no strangers to each other. They've dealt with each other here in the Fed for at least six seasons at this point. And Bronner's helmet is off and Mafuz gives it a throw. And Bronner pleading with the official to let him go. And Bronner laughing as he's pulled off of Mafuz. And the two of them still drawing it. Bronner <laughs> gets a cheer from the officiating crew as here's Levesque Here we go. dropping the gloves and away we go. Levesque and Stevens. Let's see if those fighting lessons from managing partner Colton Orr came in handy with Nicola Levesque. Two of them squaring off. Now they're tangling. Stevens throws a couple of rights, gets it to Levesque. Levesque trying to gain a bit of an edge. Levesque jabbing with that right arm. Here's Stevens. Stevens and Levesque trading rights. Levesque trying to get that right arm free from the sleeve. And Levesque wraps him up, trying to wrestle him down to the ice, trying to force his way. Stevens cages off. Still jostling for it. Levesque and Stevens fighting. Stevens takes a couple of rights to the chin. Here's Levesque swinging. Stevens swings and miss. Levesque drags him down to the ice. And a roar of approval from the Danbury Hattricks faithful as Nicola Levesque gets a fight victory. Well, Casey, we've been talking about the first fight at home. It comes from Nicola Levesque. And boy, is everybody on their feet here. Talk about an energizer. They've been waiting years for that to 